So the building is the home for three academic units. One is the uh, new University of Colorado BioFrontiers Institute. That's the institute that I, I direct, that I came back to Colorado to uh, be involved with. And uh, it's really a, um, a, a very special concept of bringing together physicists, chemists, computer scientists, and engineers all focused on working on problems in biology. But the building's also home to two other uh, academic units. One is the Division of Biochemistry, which is part of the Department of Chemistry and Biochemistry, which is moving down from the main uh, CU Boulder campus to this uh, uh, marvelous new facility. And the third is the Department of Chemical and Biological Engineering, also moving uh, from the main campus uh, to the new building. So the concept of the BioFrontiers Institute is really threefold. First of all, it's the research, the uh, tr trying to really move the frontiers of biomedical and biological science by bringing in the expertise from these associated disciplines like computer science, engineering, physics, and chemistry. Uh, the second major goal is educational, and uh, we're training students at multiple levels. Uh, uh, we have a new graduate program called Interdisciplinary Quantitative Biology, which again is a way of mixing up the traditional disciplines and showing the students the connectivity between the scientific disciplines before they choose a research group. Uh, undergraduate education in, is uh, really uh, of course in the classroom, but, and, and we're all teaching undergraduates, but, but very exciting is when we bring the undergraduates into the research laboratories and give them a, a project that has an unknown answer. You know, they're really working on the forefront of science. We treat them uh, very much like we treat our graduate students and, and give them independent projects that they can uh, learn how to uh, uh, get their sea legs and, 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 and really make a uh, uh, really make some of the decisions about the project themselves and be responsible for presenting it. And then the third goal of the um, uh, BioFrontiers is uh, outreach to the local uh, biotechnology uh, and high-tech community both uh, on the front range and, and throughout Colorado and uh, we're, this uh, has multiple components but one that particularly involves the new building uh, is the fact that we have core facilities like um, very uh, high uh, throughput DNA sequencing that is very expensive to set up that is used by the academic researchers and students at CU but we can make this available uh, on a fee-for-service basis to the uh, local companies and this uh, is a, uh, already being used actually this is already in progress and we have other uh, uh, facilities in the area of proteomics and bioimaging as, as well. So uh, that's one of, one of several things that we're doing to connect with uh, local industry and try to really make a sustainable biotechnology um, uh, industrial movement in the state.